This is the Uptick Network Stock Day Podcast, sponsored by InvestorsHangout.com. Penny stock news and interviews from the microcap world. Public information on OTC, pink sheets, and microcap stocks from around the world. With your host, Everett Jolly. This is Jason Blair filling in for Everett Jolly. Today we have a very special guest. His name is Isaac Sutton. He is the CEO of Tazier Limited. Uh, they're trading under the OTC pink sheets under the ticker symbol T-A-E-R. Isaac, welcome to the show. Uh, thank you, Jason, for having me today. Oh, it's our pleasure. Uh, go ahead, Isaac, and tell us a little bit about yourself and how you got into the Tazier Limited. Um, I've been uh, interested in energy savings uh, for a number of years now, um, focused on LED lighting. And I now came across a, a, a even a better opportunity to create smart cities. So we are in the process of of making cities smarter by implementing LED streetlights. Uh, as you know, LED streetlights save 80% energy. So by installing these streetlights, cities now um, have an immediate savings from the energy costs, from the maintenance costs, from the replacement costs. And uh, we're focusing on cities around the world to implement this uh, new LED lighting. Um, so we've just started with Tarzier uh, about uh, about six months ago. Uh, we are working worldwide. We are working uh, um, to bring these LED streetlights to municipalities around the world. Uh, we're working on what's so called a PPP platform, a public-private partnership. Uh, that is whereby we um, and our partners in China fund the uh, the actual project costs, the, the hardware and the uh, installation, and then we share with the sa with the city the savings of the energy on an ongoing basis for a number of years. Is Smart City already implemented now? And if so, what cities or what countries are they already located in? Well, Smart City is a, is a concept that's uh, uh, working around the world. Uh, what's happening is is most cities are becoming more populated. Um, even New York City is becoming, there's still a, a growth in New York City going on, growth going on in Mexico City and Sao Paulo, Brazil. So all these cities need to utilize their resources better. Uh, it, it's very hard for them to provide the quality of life uh, as the population grows. So there's a whole movement right now about smart cities to use their resources better, to use the data and the information that's available to make smarter, better decisions. Um, Tarzier as a company is now focusing on energy because the, that's the main uh, expense that a city has. And if we could save them money on their energy, if we could save them on their maintenance, on their replacement costs for their street lights, that's one plus for the cities around the world. And uh, that's what we're focusing on at Tarzier. Excellent. And now who are the big players in the smart city arena? Well, because it's a, it's a new concept, uh, you do have the major players like Cisco, IBM, Google. They are all reaching out for smart city applications. And again, there is not just one way to make that city smart. It could be in multiple ways. But by having our streetlights, what we're looking at is creating a network. So if we have the streetlights, we can create a Wi-Fi network on top of the streetlights and we can then put applications on this streetlight platform. Applications like uh, parking, um, such as um, response to um, a, a traffic accidents. Uh, we can then monitor for pollution. We can monitor for noise levels. Um, if there's a gunshot, we can now alert the authorities pretty quickly in real time. So again, uh, you know, the, the way to get a city smart or, or to make a city smart, there are multiple ways and uh, there are major companies involved like Google, IBM, Cisco, um, um, Siemens, Johnson Controls, uh, companies that have been dealing with a lot of data, a lot of information are definitely involved. Uh, and again, how Tarzier is looking to be involved is by implementing our streetlights as a network and connecting the streetlights, creating controls that monitor and manage the street lights, but on top of that, uh, if you layer on top Wi-Fi, you now have a, a a network within the city now that you can layer on 
different applications to make that city smarter and be able to utilize their data more efficiently and make them uh, a better quality of life for this, for their inhabitants. Wow, that's incredible. Uh, I mean, you're basically taking uh, a, a, an energy solution and it, turning it into a networking solution all in one you know, fell swoop. And what's really unique is that it pays for itself uh, so that the cities are, are, are able to implement these new streetlights through the energy savings. Uh, for example, we're working in one Caribbean country, city. They have 20,000 streetlights. The project costs us $7 million. But the savings, the energy savings that we earn is a million and a half dollars per year for the next 20 years. Wow, that's that's incredible. So it not only pays for itself, but you're, you're talking about it paying two to three times over itself just for the cost and the savings alone. Correct. So that's a great revenue generator for the city. Absolutely. My guest today is Isaac Sutton. He is the CEO of Tazier Limited. They're trading under the ticker symbol T-A-E-R. Uh, Isaac, let me ask you something. Recently in March, you guys formed a joint venture with Noble Soul Power for energy generating projects in the Philippines. What's the current status of that project and what are your long-term goals? Um... Novasol has is a company that um, uh, uh, develops projects around the world. One of their projects are in is in the Philippines, where they have uh, created a project with a municipal utility to produce energy. Uh, Novasol came to us and they've asked for our assistance. Uh, we've joint ventured with them to continue this project, and basically what this project is is to create a uh, a power plant that produces 100 megawatts worth of energy. We have the municipal utility looking to uh, buy that uh, output for the next 10 years. Uh, and we're at currently we're um, we're trying to finalize the final details of the guarantees by the uh, municipal utility uh, to Tarzier in order for us to then. Uh, um, get the financing so that we could then install the equipment and be able to start generating electric. Um, hopefully, once the uh, uh, the plant is operating, um, the um, the yield of the electric is about sixty five billion dollars a year for the next ten years. Wow, that's incredible, and and also like, definitely a region of the world that could definitely use the extra power with the with the population growth in that section of the world. Correct. Correct. Awesome. Uh, and also, another thing I noticed here is that you recently started your new website, which is lightupamerica.net. Um, go into a little bit about the website and also tell us about your freebate program that you guys are currently uh, implementing. Um, Tazier, like, like I had mentioned, is, uh, is involved in LED lighting. Some of our shareholders are in the LED manufacturing in China. Um, and so we decided to uh, create a LED website for the consumer to buy. But the, the real uh, thrust of the website is to offer our freebate program. Our freebate program is basically where we'll give free bulbs away for customers that sign up on our energy program. So if you actually sign up and we become your energy supplier, and again, uh, 17 states in America have been deregulated so that you can choose your energy provider, so if you choose uh, Tarzier as your energy provider of choice, we will not only give you uh, green energy, but we will also give you LED bulbs that will reduce your energy and save you money. And uh, part of our program is uh, as long as you are an energy user from Tarzier, we will guarantee and warranty these bulbs for life. So you would never have to buy another bulb for your house again. Wow, the the savings potential there is is unbelievable. And so they just go to the website and they just sign up uh, as an energy uh, customer. Correct. So uh, either at the website they either could purchase the bulbs outright, or they could sign up to be our energy uh, user, and uh, we will then be in touch with them. Uh, uh, obviously, uh, each customer is different in terms of how many bulbs will give away for free. So basically, based on their electric bill and their consumption, will then determine how many bulbs they would receive. That's great. That's an awesome program to get on. Again, the website is lightupamerica.net. 
Uh, again, my guest today is Isaac Sutton. He is the CEO for Tazier Limited. They are trading under the OTC pink sheets under the ticker symbol T-A-E-R. Isaac, in closing, was there any other information that you'd like to get out to our listeners before we wrap up today? Uh, yes, Tarzier is a fairly new company with a big vision in the energy sector and smart city sector. Um, just like our uh, our name, uh, Tarzier is a small little animal with big eyes. We have big eyes. We're the small guy uh, in the group. Uh, obviously, energy companies are much larger than Tarzier. Uh, but as the Tarzier does, we move quickly. Uh, we are able to... Uh, work on different opportunities and especially in the smart city arena area where it's uh, in the embryonic stages we have a good chance of uh, um, gaining some uh, um, uh, territory and become a major player in the smart city world so uh, i love everybody just to follow tarzier again the symbol is t-a-e-r and looking forward to uh talking to uh, potential shareholders. Excellent. Isaac, it's been a pleasure to have you on the show today. Uh, we hope to check back with you in a couple months and follow up with you on your recent projects and uh, wish you the best of luck. Thank you, Jason. Thanks again for having me. 